Welcome to the Month in Review Briefing. This briefing will highlight the weather of July 2014, as well as the temperature and precipitation outlooks for the month of August 2014. This graphic is from the High Plains Regional Climate Center and shows the departure from normal temperatures for the month of July 2014. The time period for the normals is 1981 to 2010. A value of zero would mean that the location reported a normal average temperature for the month of July. The entire region reported above normal temperatures for the month, with some locations around 6 degrees above normal. The bullseye over Benton County and the one in southern Kittitas County are due to bad observations. The next graphic is also from the High Plains Regional Climate Center. This shows the percent of normal precipitation for the northwest for the month of July 2014. A value of 100% means that the location reported their average monthly total precipitation. For July 2014, locations near the Cascades, as well as a few places in the Blue Mountains, reported well above normal precipitation amounts due to thunderstorms with heavy rain. Elsewhere, total precipitation for the month of July was well below normal. A ridge of high pressure settled over the region for several days, leading to a period of hot weather during the month of July 2014. Several weather stations broke or tied maximum temperature records the afternoon of the 16th. Condon, Oregon reported 100 degrees, breaking the previous record of 99 degrees set in 1941. The Hermiston Airport in Oregon reported 108 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1941. Monument, Oregon reported 108 degrees, breaking the previous record of 105 degrees set in 2003. Pendleton, Oregon reported 105 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1941. Redmond, Oregon reported 100 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1960. Ellensburg, Washington reported 102 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1941. Kennewick, Washington reported 108 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1911. Walla Walla, Washington reported 105 degrees, tying the previous record set in 1984. Whitman Mission in Washington reported 105 degrees, breaking the previous record of 103 degrees set in 1979. And Yakima, Washington reported 107 degrees, breaking the previous record of 101 degrees set in 1973. Under high pressure, many locations in the area reported several days of maximum temperatures 95 degrees or higher. Long Creek reported four consecutive days at or above 95 degrees, ending July 31st. This was the fourth longest stretch of days at or above 95 degrees. The longest stretch is seven days, ending August 15, 1967. Kennewick reported 14 consecutive days at or above 95 degrees, ending July 20th. This was the fourth longest stretch of days at or above 95 degrees. The longest stretch is 31 days, ending August 13, 1971. Walla Walla reported 12 consecutive days at or above 95 degrees, ending July 17. This was the fourth longest stretch of days at or above 95 degrees. The longest stretch is 22 days, ending August 21, 1977. Whitman Mission reported 14 consecutive days at or above 95 degrees, ending July 20. This was the second longest stretch of days at or above 95 degrees. The longest stretch is 15 days, ending August 22, 1977. And Yakima tied for the longest consecutive days at or above 95 degrees with 13 days. The previous record was a stretch of 13 days, ending August 18, 1981. And now we will turn our attention to the forecast for August 2014. This graphic is issued by the Climate Prediction Center, or CPC, and is the temperature outlook for the month of August. The cool colors indicate a greater chance of below normal temperatures, and the warm colors represent a greater chance of above normal temperatures. The time period for the normals runs from 1981 to 2010. The Pacific Northwest is forecast to have a greater chance of above normal temperatures for the month of August. This graphic is CPC's precipitation outlook for the month of August. The green colors represent a greater chance of above normal precipitation, and the brown colors represent a greater chance of below normal precipitation. The region is under equal chances. 
This means that the probability of the most likely category cannot be determined, and the expected likelihood of above, below, or near normal temperatures doesn't differ from the climatological odds of 33.3% for each category. Please remember that these are probabilities of averages, and that the day-to-day -day weather will still vary for the month of August. This concludes our briefing. Please continue to visit National Weather Service webpages for the latest weather information, including watches, warnings, and advisories. Thank you for your time.